Fest, we try to make it something for everybody. Sure, it's about the Jeeps and it's about like this iconic brand, but it's about the people of Toledo and Northwest Ohio and really what makes us tick. And really like embracing the arts and showing off like young people and their imaginations and their creativity is just another aspect of Jeep Fest. And this is the first year we're partnering with Toledo School for the Arts and the students there to do this real project. Berkey uh, approached us and said, look, we have this long history with Jeep. You wouldn't believe it, but Toledo School for the Arts, our building used to be a Jeep uh, plant of sorts, and that was a long time ago, but now students are still inspired, you know, by the history of our building, and there's this nice synergy between Jeep and Toledo School for the Arts. We started talking, and it, it just became really clear to us that a lot of students would have fun with this canvas of, you know, the seven-slot Jeep grill. So the, the students have done such a great job creating amazing grills and amazing artwork. It's all different. You can just get a glimpse into their mind and how their creativity is working. For me to see grills all the time move around on Jeeps in the seven slots is cool. But really to see them come to life in this way where students have really thought about you know, their designs and uh, some things are really um, abstract and then some things are really literal. Some of the grills are really coming to life with things on them. Some of them are painted flat. I mean, it's just, it's just amazing to see the creativity. This one behind us, it's called Engine Dwellers. It's uh, inspired by like nature reclaiming the Jeep. I kind of brought to this my recent interest in model making um, and some techniques that I've learned uh, through doing that. And um, so a lot of it was working with like foam and, and tools and scraping and a lot of texture in that. And, um, and then Lily took it from there. Well, it was actually kind of funny because for the longest time I had no idea what I was gonna do. And so eventually I just made myself like sit down and draw until I had an idea that I liked. I think it had a lot to do with, I had just gotten back from a family vacation at Hocking Hills State Park. And it's beautiful there. So I got a lot of the natural inspiration from that. I think it's great for, for both, you know, the students here at Toledo School for the Arts and for Jeep Fest. It kind of expands both of their, uh, you know, their thoughts on, on, on stuff. So you're seeing, you know, not just, you know, really cool Jeeps and stuff at Jeep Fest, but artwork, you know, being brought in there, which is kind of neat. I think people will see this and, and look at Jeeps a little differently, you know, because of it and stuff. And, same with, uh, you know, taking the students here and using something that's been kind of iconic here in Toledo for so long and, and, and making it into a work of art. You know, I think it's a, a really neat uh, thing that they, they're doing. Some of the pieces are very thought-provoking. Uh, it makes you, you know, really kind of think about what each artist is trying to say. You know, some of the materials, you know, the piece that's completely made out of glass and, and nothing else, uh, or using just steel pipe in order to create a Jeep grill. You know, it's just, it's, it's pretty awesome. As people come to Jeep Fest, there are a lot of Jeeps to see. There's a lot of good food, there's a lot of good music, but really seeing the artwork and the love of Jeep and these grills and the partnership between Toledo Jeep Fest and these kids is really special. And that's what the Jeep brand is all about. It's all about differences. It's all about people using their creativity. It's all about adventure. It's all about, you know, live out loud and have fun. And so that's what we're really trying to do with this project is have fun. Mm -hmm.